What is up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. We're hunting two pound coins again today. And we've got a nice bit of daylight on the situation for a change. The sun is streaming in the window. It's nice and early, filming at a very different time of day to what I usually do. Uh, but we're doing what we can at the minute. And let's refresh our memory what we still need. Yeah, just the one, the Commonwealth Games England. We've got the other three different nations. Just need England now to complete the whole collection. Everything else we've got. One day soon, hopefully, we will find it. I'm not in a hurry, I'll be honest, because I think we've done well finding the ones we've found so far. So, so scarce, these Commonwealth two pounds. Let's see what we can find today. If we don't find that, hopefully we can find some other interesting coins. Let's do it. I'm not sure where this has come from, this one. It's actually a bit open now, so we don't even cut it. Watch it be full of Commonwealths or something now. <laughs> Hopefully it is. Right, not only was the bag open at the top, but I managed to lose my phone off of the stand. So, yeah, this is going off to a brilliant start. I'm going to cut that because everything's just getting stuck to it anyway. I should have just cut that from the start. Right, <laughs> shambolic. Oh, I better be something good in there now. Let's do it. The edge looks strange for a second there. I'm not sure about this sunlight actually. It's making me cause shadows and everything, isn't it? Not a good start though, nothing commemorative in the first one. I'm gonna have to tilt this way. There's St. Paul's Cathedral, the VE Day anniversary. Very common one though, the most common. Yeah, I'm not sure we'll do the sunlight thing again. Or oh, shiny 2015. You know what we've got to check there? No, that one's okay. Oh, slow start here. Right, I'm going to draw these curtains. Okay, that's a bit better. <laughs> we can see what we're doing now. We tried it. Oh no, it's a 2013. Quite shiny though. There's another find. 400 year anniversary of the gunpowder plot. Pretty common one though, again, that one. And there's another. Two in a row. There's a fake. Not what we want to be finding, is it? <laughs> Die rotation on that one. 2011, I think we've got this type of this date already. But we'll pop that over to the side. That's not what we want to be finding. Hopefully there's not any more of those in here. There's a Charles Darwin. Cool coin that one, great design. But unfortunately, pretty common. Oh, what a shambles of a start. Open bag, there's Lord Kitchener. 2014, pretty common though. Open bag, knocked the camera off the stand. Lighting was dreadful. There's Charles Dickens. Another common one though. 
At least we're finding things. Our luck on two pounds has been immense recently, so we really cannot complain. Seen a few comments saying I'm not going to be able to complain for a while now after the luck we have been having. It's our last few two pound hunts have been pretty immense. Now here's something, probably Shakespeare's histories. Yep, <laughs> another really common one. We find tons and tons of those. I will of course have a close look through, as I always do afterwards, for any errors, any in particularly nice condition that we've missed. Especially looking for those lovely die rotations that we love. Our last video on the channel was a 20p hunt. Don't think we'll be doing that one again. <laughs> we didn't find nothing, but for the uh, effort, I'm not so sure. Maybe one day we'll do another one, see if our luck's any better. We're never going to find the undated 20p if we don't look for it, are we, I guess? So There's Brunel's portrait from 2006. Shiny one. That's all right, though. About halfway through, I think. It's another fake. It's another fake. So annoying. And there's another. St. Paul's Cathedral, the VE Day Anniversary. I wouldn't be surprised if I've missed one or two as well, if there's two that we've managed to spot as we're hunting. When you go fast, some of the technologies are somewhat passable, this technology side, the reverse. We may have someone else's hunt here, who knows? A lot of technology only bags now here at the end, maybe somebody hunted 100 pounds or something. I just cashed in a load of technologies. Absolutely rattling through these <laughs> when you're finding nothing. There's something different. That's the Army Centenary, World War One. Minted in 2016. Again, really common though. There's another one though. That's the Act of Union. 300 years of union between Scotland and England. Again, though, it's a pretty common one. And another VE anniversary as well. Come on, three more bags. Give us that Commonwealth England to finish our book. That would be epic. There's another Darwin. An ultimate bag. It's a shiny one. 2013 again though. Nothing. Last bag. Come on. It's been rubbish so far. Complete shambles from start to finish. <laughs> Nothing. But as I said, we can't really complain because our luck recently has been immense. If you want to see a better £2 coin hunt, go back and check some of the last few out because we've had some absolute brilliant ones. Star find, Whew, that's a, a toughie. There's no keepers here at all. 
I think we might have had somebody else's hunt. We found two fakes, which are mildly interesting. Other than that, I guess it's the Shakespeare because some people are still struggling to find these, I think, but we get a lot of these around here. There we go, probably our worst two pound hunt for a while. Not a great way to start the new year, but fingers crossed some point this year, we might get this book finished and maybe we can start another one, we'll see. Drop us a thumbs up. I'll see you soon for some more coiny goodness. Take care. Yeah.